Hey guys, Wolfie here and welcome back to the channel. As always, the usual disclaimer. Any opinion here is mine and mine alone. So you're hearing <clears throat> the, um, the, uh, the blow dryer. One of my roommates is drying their hair, so that's that on that. So for this particular video, I will be um, going over some plants with the, um, the bills, you know, after it posts, worst case scenario, etc., etc., you might be hearing the cat meowing. Sandy the tabby says hi. I am giving a little attention right now. But like I said, this is going to be the plants, you know, like varying, with varying aspects of, a, of, of the build itself. You know, best case scenario, worst case scenario, etc., etc. Now, before people are wondering, uh, the part five, part five is not going to come about... Because I'm waiting for two more um, badge stickers. Now, in part four, I made a pretty big error on the number of badge stickers I was waiting on. At the time of part four, it, I was actually waiting for three badge stickers. And, and I said two in, that, in part four. Fortunately, one of the three actually did show up. So I'm waiting for two other badge stickers. And when it comes to varying badge stickers, which tells people, you know... That's what's inside the build. You can easily find almost all of them on eBay. You can find a few here and there on Amazon, although Amazon is a little more tricky to find as opposed to eBay, in my personal opinion. Now, regarding the uh, the peel that's tied to the tempered glass side of the, of the, of the chases, I'm not going to be doing the peel, and it will not be filmed because I'm going to be making sure... That the driver, he gets to do the peel once I give him the, this, the finished product here. So, um, that's the, um, that part um, for the the build itself and sets of the components. Should it not post, I will I will be doing a bit of an investigation in the sense of like, okay, what happened? How can I correct this? Do I need to replace the motherboard, etc., cetera, etc.? Cetera. And the reason why, you know, I want to mention that is because, you know, I'm the one building it. It's like, I got to do what I got to do to fix it so that way it is a fully functioning product. And like I said before, I did do a BIOS flashback on the motherboard. And some people like would probably be all like, oh, you don't need to do it if it's compatible right out of the box. Just because it says it's compatible right out of the box doesn't always mean it is. So sometimes doing a BIOS flashback is a a CYA measure and by that cover your ass meaning that you did everything you could on your end to make sure everything is truly compatible because you know some of the older uh, AMD motherboards you know, it's like when they originally came out they were not compatible with the 5000 series of AMD CPUs now that a bunch of them are you have to do that BIOS flashback just to cover your ass and I'm not just saying it, you know, just to, like just to say it. It's more so that's that's what's going on in the in this particular industry. That sort of thing. <clears throat> so with that being out of the way, I do have it, you know, in prep in the sense of like, okay, the wires where they need to be. Um, this is a uh, the keyboard right here. It is a bit of a chank one. I live right by a Walgreens, so this is one of those easy for me, easy to buy items for me. And this right here is also for Walgreens. It's cheap, but, you know, it does the job in the sense of, like, when I test the builds, um, making sure things are posted, that sort of thing. And then um, <clears throat> once I get this thing to post, I will enable DOCP. That is the AMD equivalent to XMP. And it is important to do that for your build to run at its best. Regardless if the regardless of the number of the megahertz on the RAM, aka the memory. Now I have um did a little booklet. I the driver has it in his hand, so he has like the booklet, you know, with all the information you know about the build, you know, and I put it in the build put it in the booklet, you know, some legal stuff, you know, for him to keep in mind you know, when it comes to streaming, using music, all that stuff. Um so he has that. I also gave him the boxes of some of the components. So that way, in the event he has to send things out, you know, to RMA, you know, he has the box with the serial number ready to go. 
So, um, on that note, like I said, that's a, that's that on that. So, um, to do a bit of a recap, um, when it comes to the the plastic part of this particular side of the of the case, it's going to be off camera. I'm going to have the driver do it. I actually have the box for the case right over there. So he's going to be doing the peel, and it's going to be off camera because it's more more than likely going to be at work. And unfortunately, I'm not really allowed to film at work, especially on company time. In addition, you know, if for some reason this does not post, I'm going to, you know, do an investigation, you know, okay, what did I do wrong? How could I fix it? That sort of thing. Um, I do have, like, you know, my the jank keyboard and mouse setup. I do have the Wi-Fi card installed. You may probably not gonna be able to see it very well at all, if at all. It is towards the bottom. I put it on a lower PCIe slot so that way it gives the gra graphics card a little more breathing room. Um, there is a chance here that that is the 3060. <clears throat> there is the, the possibility I'm gonna get a what's known as GPU um, backplate. So that way, you know, he has something, you know, something more pleasing to look at than that. Now, the monitor here, you know, that helps me, you know, with testing look, testing the builds, make sure things are posted. So I have that all ready to go. And all that good stuff. So, um, and I'm going to be using this particular power strip, which is tied to this particular um, computer. And fortunately for me, I did some changes here and there in a recent time, so... It, my main streaming area, as you can see here, it is a little bit cleaner. But back to this. So, the um, peeling of this particular plastic is going to be done off screen and more than likely at work. Um, if I have to replace the parts in the build, should it not post, I will. I have everything set up, you know, where it's supposed to be plugged in. Um, so that way, you know, once I hopefully I get the post, all that good stuff, that's going to be the proper part five. But I just want to give you guys a bit of an update, you know, what's going on. So, um, and to be more specific on the case badges, it's not going to be this one. Although for this one, I might be replacing this one pretty soon. Because this one right here is not really reliable in my personal opinion. Now, I'm probably going to angle this somewhat. So, um, this, that's the CPU um, badge right there. That comes with the CPU, and this I ordered off of eBay, so <clears throat> so I'm just waiting for one that says, that says uh, Geoforce RTX, as well as the, um, and, and one that says uh, Asus Republic of Gamers, so that's the two I'm waiting on. <clears throat> Before I test it, I should be getting those any day, but when it comes to the build itself right here, I am very pleased with the sense of the cleanling, clean, cleanliness. I need to English today, folks. Because sometimes English is fucking hard at times. And yes, I swear. So, um, it is it is one of the cleaner builds I've done to date. And fortunately, it's not mine. And I like this, uh, this particular way this turned out for the, the cooler. I really like that because it's like, it's like more of, the, more of what I envisioned the build to be. Now, I'm going to notify the driver, you know, that he can put like a small toy here and there if he wants in the future, so I'm gonna let him know on that because I know that some people do like to put like a small figurine in there. Um, regarding this computer and um, let me grab my phone here. So those two computers, I actually have a figurine inside of those. Although the computer in my bedroom does not have a figure in there, it's just something I do need to look into in that regard. <clears throat> so uh, to conclude. That's pretty much it. And again, this is more of a video log than part f than anything. And part five, once I get the two remaining uh, case badges, then I will be doing the test because that will hopefully signal that I'm completely done with this computer. And I could give this to the driver, you know, on a future date. So that is that on all of that, if I had to be completely honest. With Wolvie here signing off, I will catch you all on the flip side.